Hey, what's going on, folks, and welcome to another Reputized Video. Halloween came out in 1978, was directed by John Carpenter, and stars Jamie Lee Curtis, Nancy Loomis, PJ Souls, Donald Pleasance. It's all about this escaped mental patient who escapes from a place called Smith Grove Sanitarium. He goes to this quiet little fictionist town known as Hattonville, Illinois, and he stalks these babysitters. He wears a a white mask, and he just goes around and stalks babysitters. That's basically it. This movie, from what I understand, was made for around $300,000, and it made a little over a million. And that was a definite cash cow then. Everything about this movie was done perfectly. This movie is what really started the horror genre into the slasher age. Yeah, we already had Psycho and the Texas Chainsaw Massacre by then, but Halloween was really inspirational to other filmmakers. Sean S. Cunningham actually took inspiration from Halloween to make Friday the 13th. Halloween is, is a classic. And, you know, you can't beat what John Carpenter did. You know, many have tried, but many has failed. Jamie Lee Curtis's character is one of those shy types that doesn't really want to do much. She's one of those... Goody Two Shoes. Her friends, played by Nancy Loomis and PJ Souls, was the partying type and the promiscuous type. We all know in horror movies which ones to go in those scenarios. The music by Alan Howarth and John Carpenter was excellent. The, the famous. To this day, is a pop culture in any language. Pretty much. The characters was well built. There was a lot of good chemistry there before the shape. Is what they called him in this one. Before the shape started stalking. John Carpenter's direction was just fantastic. Like I said, there's nobody in this world that could do what he did. He created something masterful. And nobody could triumph over that. That's a fact. No, oh, that rhymed. The cinematography, the lighting, the pacing, the scares, everything you would want in a horror movie. Now the only thing though, if you're going to rent this movie and expect to see a lot of gore, don't hold your breath. It wasn't one of those movies. It was more about the scares than anything else. It's not a bad thing, but I know most people nowadays, this was back 40 years ago. So most people nowadays, they're expecting all this bloodshed and all that. This isn't the movie for you if you're wanting all that. But it is a good movie to try. It is something that started a whole slew of sequels and a whole slew of different type of movie sequels as well. The pros was it was a masterful movie. One of the most iconic horror icons in cinema history was born. I just can't not tell you how popular this series has grown. The cons to some of you, I mean, to me, personally, I, I don't mind gore, which is why I'm kind of putting this into, into a con area. This is the only con I have about it. The kills was minimal. Like I said, it was more about the scares, the intensity of it. In closing, this movie is definitely worth your time. If you like slasher films and want to see something amazing, then this is the movie for you. There's no doubt about it, guys. Halloween gets an A+. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. I really appreciate it. With the Halloween season coming up, stay tuned for more Halloween videos and reviews and trailer reactions. Like, subscribe, and get reputized. Peace to rip out.